Hey everyone, David Roche here with the Roche Group, Keller Williams. I've got my buddy Mike Marlowe with the Marlowe Brothers back with me again, talk about some mortgage information. All right, Mike, tell me uh, somebody who's purchased a house before, been in their house for a little while, and they get the, the itch, they give me a ring, and they say, hey, we're ready to buy again. Tell our listeners what are some things that you need to do in order to get your credit or get yourself ready to buy a house. Well, first of all, you need to find out what your credit scores are and these online credit services like Credit Karma and stuff like that, those are not accurate credit scores. Those are data gathering services. Why else would they give you free credit scores? They're trying to gather data. Your credit score for a mortgage credit report is completely different than what it would be for if you're purchasing a car or applying for a credit card. Different levels of risk, different levels uh, what you're doing on the loan. So you want to get your accurate credit score and you want to get a residential mortgage credit report. Completely different than anything else. You can, you know, you can get that through the year. The repository or Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion, and you get one free credit report per year, and those scores are pretty accurate. So find out what your real credit scores are is critical. I can't tell you how many times people say I'm in the 680s because Credit Karma said so, and then they're in the five. <laughs> and that's frustrating. They're like, I don't understand. You got to understand what your credit scores are. Well, first of all, where does the credit need to be to get a good interest rate? You know, that varies from lender to lender, but generally speaking, on conventional loans, most people are going to want 620 or better, minimum of 620. And you have three scores and they're going to go off the middle score. If you have two applicants, they're going to go off the lowest middle score. So you got to make sure the lowest middle score is 620 or better. We can go down to 580 on FHA, uh, 620 on conventional, 620 on VA, and 620 on USDA. 